Bodybuilding fans, welcome back to another great fit show here on Bodybuilding.com. I'm Bob Ciccarello along with super trainer Charles Glass. We're back at the Mecca of Bodybuilding Gold's Gym. Where we're about to embark on a nice big back workout with perennial national contender Jerome Ferguson. Yep, Jerome's going to be really ready this year. Uh, he made a lot of changes and I think he's going to be a man to beat. Uh, Charles, I uh, took a look at Jerome myself a couple days ago. Uh, he looked great, looked a little bit fuller, looked a little bit more cut than he even was for the USA on stage. Uh, what are some of the changes that you're going to be uh, putting in for this go round? Well, normally Jerome is accustomed to eating a lot of carbs for his show. So what we're going to do is we're going to hold back the carbs, but try to fill them up with more fats. Even Jerome has his down days when it comes to the carbs, and here he is, yeah. mustering energy to actually stand up. Big G back in the house. Last time we had him on the Fit Show, G was getting ready for the Olympia. Obviously, that's past now. Spotlight back on Jerome. Jerome, how we feeling, buddy? You know, guys, it's all I can say, man. Do you know that don't believe that tell, don't believe the little thing they say, uh, it's all in your mind? Because my mind plays so many tricks on me, man, I want to quit so many times. Good this God, his mind's gone already. Let's... Take it right here. That's it. Come on. Come on. To the lower part. There we go. Good. Squeeze it in. Come on. Lean back. Lean back. There you go. Good. Good. Jerome's kind of got a, he's got a very small waist and a very big upper lats, but I know that middle to lower back you're looking to fill out. How's that coming along? That's coming along great. We've been doing a lot of lower rows with, you know, well, partial rows. And doing a lot of low row stuff, but it can hit that lower lumbar region. So mm -hmm. it's working out really well. Okay, Charles, I see we got a couple of individual handles here, obviously looking to isolate it just a little bit more. Yeah, you know, all I'm about is isolation, you know, because what happens, a lot of guys do that same movement where they don't move their bodies. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get a full stretch as we go into the movement, and then we stop it and squeeze and contract all the way back by pulling the handles open. That allows us to get a little bit more range mm -hmm. from the back. Jerome, at this, uh, at this point in the program, tougher mentally, mentally or physically? Mentally, you're like, yeah, we can do this. But physically, dude, I've never been no energy. I mean, like, I mean, zero energy, guys. Well, nine sets coming here today. Jerome, let's get a little pump going. So much you got, brother. Come on. I noticed once again the common theme, a lot of machine work here. Again, not working too much dumbbell work at this point here, 10 days out. is It's a little bit too much effort, actually, and, and too much uh, injury uh, uh, risk. Well, we're trying to avoid that injury, you know, because all it takes is a little movement to go the wrong way, and you got to injure it. Squeeze the back. There you go. Work it. Come on. Come on. Squeeze. Come on, Jerome, quit screwing around. Yes, sir. All right, Captain. Guys. <laughs> 50 grams of car. He's loopy, actually. He's on Queer Street, for God's yeah, sakes, Jake. Yeah, he's not, uh, not himself. Remember the last time when we were shooting how much he talked? Oh, he yeah. was just a talking, talking guy. And hey, now you, you know a diet must be tough when even Jerome's a little bit quiet and, and uh, oh, he, yeah. he's gone. There you go. Perfect weight for me today. Safe, safe to say the 150-pound uh, dumbbells are going to stay exactly where they are right now. Yes, no 150-pound dumbbells <laughs> today, guys. Not today. <laughs> Not today. I'm looking at those 75, looking kind of heavy right now. <laughs> kind of gets, kind of gets a little blood flowing, doesn't it? That a boy, Jerome. Can't wait to go home and take it down. Back looks good, bro. In the good light right now, yeah. Charles, you can definitely see a difference uh, even from the USA. Uh, most people would argue that you can't really make that much of a change in, in just a, four, a few short months, but obviously it's paid off. Well, what happened, the change was already coming. We just didn't get a chance to finish it up. So by him just come jumping right back into the gym, we were able to continue what we had been working on. So that made it happen. See, most people do what? They take those long breaks. He didn't. He just jumped right back into the gym. He knew what he had to do, and we did it. I mean, like you said, 20 plus years is a long time to put something into a career that you have nothing in the, at the end. So he's worked very hard, and I think he will succeed this year. He's just got to get it. From Venice Beach, California, your own Hollywood Ferguson. Okay, in the world famous backlight here at the Mecca. Jerome's going to muster to, together enough energy here to show the fans what he's got. Squeeze it, squeeze it, squeeze it. All the way around, four more. Come on, Jerome. He throws the weight back. Yeah. Like, yeah, that looks different. good. Look, look, look at that. Yeah. That's how you do it. They can yeah. see the difference in his chest coming out when he hits that. Man, sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Squeeze it in. Yeah. Now pull. Now pull. Pull. There you go. Rotate it over. 
Nice. All right. Now bring it up, all the way up. Up, 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 up. Now bring it down. Now bring it down. Now squeeze in. Squeeze it down. Squeeze it down. Now turn it. Rotate it. Hold it there. Just rotate it. Wow. Yeah. Now push it back. Push it back right here. There you go. That's it. Oh, look at that. Good. Look how wide that back is right now. That's it. Squeeze the ham. Here you go. Having a small waist doesn't hurt. Good. Yeah. <laughs> Greg Merritt, Flex Magazine in the house. Take a look, Greg. Here you go. Ab, squeeze down the quad. Squeeze on the quad. There you go. Now put it out in front of you more and flex down on it now. Show it. You should be only in one position. You want to show it off. You got more. There you go. Yeah. Good. Woo. Man, this guy looks good. <laughs> Charles, where do you see him coming in? Uh, obviously, you haven't done anything with water manipulation yet. That's obviously going to come in next week. Uh, he's at 50, let's call him at 55 right now. Uh, where, where are you going to have him come in at the show? If he's at 55, I can see him now in like about 46, and we're in like 46, 47. And if, in 45, necessary, because if he drop another 10 pounds, he could be that much tighter. Sure. You know, you can see a lot more definition showing for him. A lot of people got gym physiques all day long, but when you get on the actual stage, what you want to see. Mm -hmm. he, he, he's there. He's there. You'll be all right. That's some damn good work right yeah. there. What can I say, buddy? You look good. Like I say, you, you feel like uh, you feel like you Whoa. got about zero energy, and, and uh, like well, you know, it could all end any second now, bro. But you know what? The mirror doesn't lie. Woo. Thank you. And everything looks really good. I think you look better than the USA right now. I think you could go on stage right now and eclipse Woo. that. Thank uh, you, Bob. But man, you're going to be in the driver's seat, bro. I think you did real good. Way to do your homework. Thanks, Bob. I really appreciate it. Once again, guys, appreciate Bobin.com fish show. Appreciate all you beautiful friends that I have to give me support to get through this. You really don't know what the outcome is going to be. You just keep trying to show up. I just appreciate all the beautiful people, all the support. Appreciate you, Bob. Appreciate Charles for hanging in there. Adam for taking care of me, man. And I, you know, we're going to do it, guys. This is for you guys, man. That's all I can say, because I couldn't do it for myself. You got it, Jerome. Ooh. All for Adam, for Gunther, the German giant, for Charles Glass, super trainer. This is Bob Ciccarello saying we'll see you next time right here at the Mecca of Bodybuilding. We'll catch up with Jerome. <sighs>